Hey, what's up everybody? This is Jonathan Coates and in today's free AI training, I'm going to be talking about generative AI and I'm going to be sharing with you some resources, tidbits and techniques to help you further understand and have access to stuff so that you can properly apply and start using. Now, most people's understanding of generative AI is from ChatGPT and other applications, Copilot, Gemini, etc. I just want to give a more in-depth breakdown that me and the affiliate marketing samurai came up with together. So I have an entire document that you should see here right in the description. There's, there's three different parts here. The first one is what is generative AI? I'm going to be going over that. The second part is how does it work? And then how you can actually apply generative AI. So I'm going to be giving you the different applications here now. Starting at the top, I want to talk about the way it works, like the training, learning, and creation. And then I'm going to be getting into text generation image, which is a phenomenal text to image slash image to image image to video software that I actually just made a, a video on a full fledged tutorial that you can I'll have it in the description I'll try to link it in the cards as well but just to kind of give you some more information about how this whole process works generative AI is a type of artificial intelligence that can create new content such as text images videos or even music and as you can see here all the way at the bottom they have all their different models and this is just on runway so they actually have a music compository and with generative AI it's like having a creative partner that can generate ideas designs or stories based on the information that's been trained on now there's a lot of other different models too text to image just as like from Canva image FX this is probably image in three now from Google but this was the AI test kitchen that they had at that time I believe they have a newer model is called image in three but I'm just going to go ahead and sign in to show you a little bit what this looks like. But I don't want to go too in detail with this. I just really want to show you their model and as well as other models as well. So this is their AI test kitchen. And with this, I've been able to make some really cool images, but you can do the same thing with WhatsApp. So let me go ahead and sign in. So as you can see, photo of gold and ruby treasures, sparkling in a cave, shadows and sunbeams, treasure hunter in the foreground. Really cool stuff, if you ask me. So how does it work? The AI has fed vast amounts of data, text, images, etc. to learn patterns and relationships. Learning, the AI identifies patterns and structures within the data and creation. Based on the learned patterns, the AI can generate new content that resembles the training data, but is original. So different examples of generative AI is always showing you with text generation image generation, music composition, and video creation. Now with Runway, you can also create videos as well. And again, I'll refer you to my tutorial on that. I actually give you an overview of how that works. So text or images to video, or you can even take a previous video and create a new, you can generate a brand new original video out of that. Generative AI is a type of artificial intelligence that can create new content such as text images. It's based on a complex architecture known as neural network, which is inspired by the human brain. So here's a simplified breakdown of the process, data ingestion. The AI model is trained on a massive data set of relevant information. For example, a text generating model might be trained on a vast collection of books, articles, and code. Pattern recognition, the model analyzes the data to identify pattern structures and relationships between different elements. This is where the neural network's ability to learn and adapt comes into play. Number three, model creation. Based on the identified patterns, the model creates a complex mathematical representation of the data. This representation captures the underlying structure and rules of the information. And number four, content generation. When prompted with a specific task or query, the model uses its learned patterns to generate new content. This involves making predictions about the most likely continuation of the given input. And some of the key components here is the neural networks. These are interconnected layers of artificial neurons that process information and training the process of feeding the model massive amounts of data to learn patterns and inference the process of using the trained model to generate new content. So it's important to note that generative AI doesn't truly understand the content that it's generating. It's essentially making educated guesses based on the patterns that it has learned. The quality of the generated content depends heavily on the quality and quantity of the training data. Now let's get into the different applications of generative AI, which is rapidly transforming industries with this ability to create new content from text and images to music and code. Here's a breakdown of some key applications. So text, generating articles, blog posts, scripts, code, email, and more. I have a whole slew of videos. Let me just go to my content real quick on creating code, creating blog posts, and everything that's mentioned right here, I have complete tutorials on. 
especially when it comes to generating articles and I even have a video called Auto Code Rover as well as other open source software engineer type models or even just for using your basic LLM for generating code. Email, I have entire playlist on email marketing and there's a lot of different videos where I include the application of AI to help assist you with that process. It really frees time up. I mean what would normally take me about three months to create like a four or five chapter long newsletter meaning it branches out over the course of several months took me one weekend with AI image creating realistic images art and designs based on textual descriptions and I actually just created a tutorial on how to properly prompt your images so that you get the results that you want this stuff like style modifiers and quality boosters to further enhance the image to make it more robust majestic realistic etc and you can even reference famous artist styles if you want to use a certain type of style for your image. Design and product development. So product design, generating new product ideas and designs. I have about four different videos on that subject specifically and I'll try to link those but mainly when it comes to like the logo, the headline, the box art, stuff like that. Fashion design, creating new clothing styles and patterns, architecture, designing builder, designing buildings and structures, game development, generating game environments, characters and I have videos on this as well marketing advertising content creation I have a plethora a slew of videos on how to generate marketing copies social media posts and ad campaigns so be sure to check out my playlist and I'll try to have those in the description as well personalized marketing tailoring content to specific audiences customer service providing AI powered chatbot for customer interactions in fact I just created two videos on how to create an AI call center so that you can create your own sales force all AI powered and completely automated now obviously you don't want to just leave it up to the sales force to do everything on its own you want to have like a human there to make sure you know you're getting the, the results that you you're intending it's really awesome that you can automate the entire sales force with AI essentially at this point and it's only getting better by the day education personalized learning creating customized learning experiences for students content creation generating educational materials such as quizzes and exercises and tutoring which can provide Providing AI powered tutoring assistance. A lot of people are learning different languages now. And healthcare, drug discovery, accelerating the drug discovery process, medical image analysis, analyzing medical images for diagnosis, personalized medicine, developing tailored treatment plans. And then other industries include finance, law, and entertainment. You can generate financial reports, analyzing market trends detecting fraud so just as easily as people can use AI to scam you can also use AI to prevent scam and fraud law automating legal documents drafting and analysis entertainment creating new characters storylines and scripts now the more lazy people are in going about doing this the lower the quality of the results and the more easy it is for people to tell this AI but if you're really really deliberate and you do your research and fact check and just you know back check your words go over it a few times just make sure is what you want it to be and what you intend it to be and then just try to be quality conscious then you can really have something that's absolutely phenomenal and accurate it doesn't you know have like the typical you know BS that you see on the internet these days where people are just so lazy they just put in a prompt in and they just take whatever the thing spits out all right so that's just an overview and introduction to generative AI this video I wanted to keep this brief if you like content like this then I definitely recommend that you subscribe to the channel I talk about everything when it comes to generating traffic and increasing sales and just be sure to check out my playlist on artificial intelligence automation as you can see I have almost 60 videos just on this subject as well and as well as copywriting tutorials and email marketing strategies I was saying when it comes to you know generating newsletters and robust email campaigns all right so be sure to take a look at the tools and the resources below I have everything that I included in this video as well as the pinned comment by the affiliate marketing samurai and right in the description I have an AI checklist that can help you to boost your efficiency and creativity it's completely free all you gotta do is you put your name and your email address in and it'll get sent right to your inbox all right so with that said I hope you enjoyed I'll see you in the next video see you then